There we go, guys. We finally got it. There we go, guys. The Super, the Super Nintendo Classic. We got it. I can't wait to go home and unbox this, so let's go home and let's start playing this thing. Hey everybody! Okay, I'm back home now. We got the SNES and we're ready to unbox it. Take it out of the bag. Oh, look at that thing! So, I've actually never had my own Super Nintendo and I guess this is the closest thing I'm gonna get to it. The Super Nintendo was kind of before my era. So I'm super excited to play this now. My pre-order from Walmart did get back ordered. So I decided to go to Target and get this. So why don't we get to the unboxing, shall we? Oh, here we go. So this is the Super Nintendo Classic Edition. So this comes pre-installed with 21 of the greatest Super Nintendo games. So we got Contra 3, The Alien Wars, Donkey Kong Country, Earthbound, Final Fantasy 3, F-Zero, Kirby's Dream Course, Kirby Superstar, Mega Man 10, Secret of Mana, Star Fox. Very excited for that. Street Fighter 2 Turbo, Super Castlevania 4, Super Ghouls and Ghosts, Super Mario Kart, Super Mario RPG, Legend of the Seven Stars, Super Mario World, Super Metroid, Super Punch-Out, Legend of Zelda, A Link to the Past, one of the greatest Legend of Zelda games, and Yoshi's Island. And of course, you can't forget about Star Fox 2, the unreleased sequel to Star Fox. So let's open this guy up. Yeah, so Super NES console, Retro Blast from the past. Let's see, did, did Nintendo do the little label? Here we go. Now you're playing with super power. Always loves the little touches. Okay, so when you open it, is it this way up? Yeah, you get like a poster. So let's see what this is. Oh, dropping it. Okay, warranty and user agreement. No one really cares about that. But this, oh wow, look at that. So. It has a few of the games, I guess the biggest games on the Super Nintendo Classic. Super Mario World, Super Metroid, Super Mario Kart, Star Fox, F-Zero, and A Link to the Past. Very cool poster. So I guess let's go for the controllers first. So this time, Nintendo put two controllers in the box. Oh, yeah. Oh, wow. So this is supposed to be as close as a replica to the original that out and they said the cord should be longer nice 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 very see I don't know I've actually never held a Super Nintendo controller so I guess this is what it feels like but Nintendo this time they did add a second controller so now you don't have to go find a second controller online somewhere you can just place two player games right out of the box Okay, and then I'm guessing here we get power brick. Yep, Nintendo branded USB wall work out. Underneath you get your, so this would be a micro USB cable to charge, or not to charge, to actually use the device to power it. So a micro USB cable and an HDMI cable because no more composite cables. We are in the realm of HDMI. Okay, so let's, let's actually go for the console itself. Wow, this is extremely light in the big reveal. Oh man. It feels, it weighs like nothing. Like this is, this feels like an empty box. Okay, so on the back you get HDMI and you get your power, which is micro USB. And let's see how these buttons feel. Ooh, just like it. They click. It's a nice click. It's not much of a click because it is a tiny button. And yeah, none of this. <laughs> there's no eject because there's no cartridges. So what they did was they actually wanted to make it look like the original, but how do we actually... From underneath? Okay. So you pull that out, and that's where your controller would plug in. Just like that. Nice. And the good thing about this controller port is this is the same controller port as the port on the bottom of the Wii remote. 
So if you do have Wii remotes, you can actually plug this in to your Wii remote and you can play your virtual console games now with a SNES controller. Like I'm still blown away how tiny this thing is. Like it fits in the palm of your hand. And I have a feeling the SNES cartridges were about the size of this thing. So it's crazy that this thing is compacted down into this tiny size. But I am super excited to set this up now. I will be streaming this tonight. I'll be playing a lot of the games on stream the release day. So that's September 29th if you're watching this on a later date. But yeah, thank you guys for watching so much, and I hope you all have an awesome day. Let me know if you guys were able to get any of the Super Nintendo Classic Editions, and as always, leave me a big thumbs up down below if you enjoyed this video. And if you're new, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, and I guess I will see you guys in my next video. Camillo out.